in this video I will show you how to set up your breakout tool in Cisco CML and access your node from your favorite terminal. So first you have to download your breakout tool and it's under tools and breakout tool and if you go down to the bottom these are the different versions of the software depending on what platform you are running. In my case I'm running Mac OS so this is what I have downloaded. Once downloaded you need to double click on it so remember to press the command key while you're opening this on your download folder and once it's downloaded you just need to start it. So I'll start my breakout tool here now I can see it's running and I have a URL that I can go to so just browse or go put this address into your URL. This will allow us to configure the breakout tool. So I put in the IP address here which is the the same IP address I'm using to access my CML workbench. Verify TLS certificate this I have disabled and populate all nodes. I would like to have this so I can have view of all the labs um, that I have. For username I'll be using the same credentials that I'm using to access CML web interface. So it's admin and my password and this is by default so I will leave it as it is and I save. Now I can go to my labs and one thing that I found that I had to do is every time I saved or make some configuration changes I had to stop the breakout tool from my terminal and restart it once more so I will do that and on here you can actually refresh and import all your labs so my one was imported already and ensure that the status is on and then I can just click on my lab and here I can see the two routers that I have available in my topology ensure that you have the access enabled the serial or console access enabled on both I can see which port is being used for the console so it's port 9000 for router 1 9002 for router 2 so I will use this information to configure my secure CRT So R1 is configured to be accessed via this RP address and this port 9000. It's essentially is the local host address that you're putting in. So I'm, I've chosen to use this host address and port 9002. And then for validation, I'll just double click and I have access to my router from my secure CRT. So this is a different way to access your notes on CML without having to use the external connectors which makes it very convenient and easier. This brings me to the end of my very short video. I hope you have enjoyed it and thank you again for watching.